So what is the quotient of 3 eighths and 5 eighths? Um, so this is a little bit of terminology. Whenever you see what is the quotient of something, it's always this number divided by that number. So that is a bit of memorization. I mean, that's just the math of it, right? It's like saying, what is the answer to dividing this number by this number? Right? That's what it means by what is the quotient. So that's just a little bit of something to, we, we do need to remember that. You know, that's just language. That's what the quotient means. It's this number divide the first number divided by the next number, right? So go ahead and divide that and see what you get. So when we divide, we just need to multiply by the reciprocal of the fraction on the right, right? Yeah. Now, should we multiply to get 24 over 40, or should we do something else first? Good job. 8 and 8 goes once, 8 and 8 goes once. Well, that's a little better, isn't it? So we got 3 times 1 is 3. 1 times 5, 5. Okay with that?